breaking, shock Trump prediction surfaces, Dems won't like this at all. Since November 2016, Democrats have been trying different ways to remove President Donald Trump from power. Unfortunately for them, one conservative strategist predicts a massive Trump victory in 2020. On Twitter, Fox News sent out a picture of former White House chief strategist Steve Bannon with a shocking caption. In Bannon's words, President Trump's not only going to finish his term, he's going to win with 400 electoral votes in 2020. This bold prediction would place President Trump alongside President Ronald Reagan, who won 525 electoral votes in 1984. In 1988, George H. W. Bush, Reagan's former vice president, defeated Massachusetts Democrat Michael Dukakis by winning 426 electoral votes. Since then, no president, either Democrat or Republican, has managed to reach 400 electoral votes. Bill Clinton came the closest in 1996, when he defeated Republican Bob Dole and Reform Party candidate Ross Perot with 379 electoral votes. The brazenness of Bannon's prediction cannot be fully understood unless one views the map of Reagan's victory in 1984. In that year, Reagan won California, New York, Massachusetts, Oregon, Washington, Nevada, Michigan, Illinois, Wisconsin, Ohio, and all of the South. Democrat Walter Mondale only won the state of Minnesota. By comparison, President Trump won with just 306 electoral votes. Hillary Clinton won New York, almost all of New England Virginia, the entire West Coast, and Illinois. Even the most positive-minded Republican strategists do not think that the GOP can win in California, New York, or in New England. Since 1984, American culture has changed too much, as millions of college graduates, many of them very liberal, have relocated to America's coastal hubs. These are the states that wield the most power in the Electoral College. Another major factor is that since 1972, the Democrats have been playing a long game of demographics. Ever since the Democrats pushed the hard Siller Act through Congress in 1965, America has gotten less Christian, less white, and less conservative. While Republicans have enjoyed success in midterm and state elections for some time now, many worry that, Unless Donald Trump's DNA can be cloned, a future Republican president will be all but impossible in the future, thanks to growing tensions between Americans. However, many did not think that President Donald Trump would win the 2016 election at all. Steve Bannon believed in him, and is often credited for saving Trump's campaign during its darkest hour. Although he has left the White House, Mr. Bannon continues to stump for nationalist populist causes including throwing his support behind outsider candidates. Bannon is currently lining up support for a slew of outsider Republicans, many of whom are aiming to take seats in the House and Senate away from establishment Republicans. In Nevada, Arizona, New York, and elsewhere, Bannon is trying to turn the GOP into a Trumpist party. If he is successful, then Bannon's prediction might not be so crazy after all. A more Trumpist GOP has a chance of winning in 2020, especially since the Democrats are, right now, exceptionally weak. The only thing that could derail the Republicans is if they continue to do nothing in Congress and if President Trump decides to move leftwards on major issues, especially immigration.